There are lots of varieties of orchids, however, Cymbidium orchids are my favorite, and I'd like to show you how to create them in sugar. It starts with the center column, and let's begin there. I begin with a one gram piece of gum paste that I'm going to knead up and roll into a sausage shape. I roll first into a ball, and then right into a sausage shape. My shape should be about an inch in length. Each one of these boxes on my mat is about an inch in length. I need to insert a wire into my sausage shape, but in order to make sure that it sticks, I've hooked the wire, I've bent over the very top of it and hooked it. I'll dip it into a little bit of edible glue and brush off the excess. I can insert it into my sausage shape and I'm gonna roll it again between my hands so it becomes about an inch and a half in length, so about a box and a half. Now, when you look at an orchid column, it has what to me look like wings. So I take tweezers and I'm going to pinch on either side of the center and pinch out some wings. And then I'll take my fingers and actually further thin them out. So it almost looks like a cobra, almost like a snake. I'm gonna take a bend and fold over the center, bend it over my thumb, and then I'm just gonna add a little teeny tiny indentation. My indentation comes from a number five pastry tip. This is just to make it look a little bit more realistic. I just push in and give it a little bit of a head. Now, this column is going to sit and dry overnight for 24 hours before I add the next piece of my center. Mm -hmm.